Okay, it's Sunday evening. It's um, gone half past eight and you can see the blue tits are very busy in and around the bird box and the babies, look at them, little heads peeking out through the little hole. The babies are almost ready to fly. I think that could be happening anytime soon. Um, you can see the baby there, one of the babies, and they're calling all the time to their parents. But um, when the little baby blue tits get to this point where they're starting to <clears throat> actually peep out from the box and call to their parents, then you know that it's only a matter of sometimes hours before they make their first flight and once they leave the box that's it they're gone now if you have a look at the bottom of the box the little front panel looks as though it's been pushed out I'd say that those babies in there are pretty big the parents have been working flying to and from the box from early in the morning to late at night. Is this bird going to fly? I think it could well do. Oh wow. Oh wow. That is amazing. Really come on. Oh look. No it says I'm going back in. Oh, I'm going to come out again. I think what's happening now is that the parents are calling to the babies. Oh, there's one of the parents back on the tree. You can't see it in the camera range. I've just watched it go in. Into the tree. Where is it now? The parents are trying to coax the babies out. I am hoping to be able to get a shot of at least one of the babies leaving the nest. This is so exciting. See this box is just outside the sitting room window. So I've sat in here evening after evening listening to those babies. Look it's I think you'd agree with me, it's very close to flying, isn't it? The parents have come back, but they haven't gone into the box. They really are trying to entice those babies into their first flight. Can you imagine just how nervous that little bird is? Oh, look! It's gone! It's gone! Where has it gone? It's gone onto the tree, I think. It's gone onto the tree somewhere. Ah, there's a second one, look. It's going to go for it too. Can you imagine the trepidation that little bird must have felt? Because I've been watching it for most of today trying to ease itself out through the hole in the box and you know will I won't I should I shouldn't I what will I do oh no I don't want to I'll go back in in I don't I it's been amazing it's been amazing I've watched this from day one when the little birds were bringing little bits of sticks and fluff and little bits of wool and dog hair and cat hair and whatever they could find in to build that nest. And now it looks like baby number two is ready to make the flight. Wow. 
My arm's getting sore here. I'll have, to, I'll have to see if I can just change around a little bit under the other arm. I'm trying to keep very still because I don't want them to be frightened off. No. little light yellow light green tree is where the is where the parents launch themselves from into the box. Come on little one. Don't be frightened, you're next. This little one is much quieter. He's sitting having a good look, thinking about the, the next move, his first flight, or perhaps her first flight. My arm's going to sleep a little bit. I may have to leave this little project. I think what I'll do is I'll just go outside. I'll take this outside now for a little while. Just pull back on that. <clears throat> I'd like to see just how far they've got. You stay there, Jack. No, stay there. No, stay there.
Okay, I'm going to leave it at that point because I don't want to frighten off the parent birds who are somewhere up in the trees behind me calling to this little one.